A deep freezer and set of coolman and some huge cash was donated to Madame Sento Samoa to change her financial status and activity. They send money, they send money, they buy fridge for me. Goodwill Ambassador sent me monies, which have made me establish a business on my own and have also prevented me from cooking for people, which I want to thank Hawabai for. Before now, Sento will be out cooking for people, but earned less, with much daunting effect on her and family. But since the help came for her, she has been able to attend to some of her family's financial needs. For the lunch, I've just came for now and now another per week. Now I don't pay us rent. Before now, I find it difficult to provide lunch for my children. But since this help came, I have paid my rent. No longer find it difficult to provide lunch for my kids, and such have also restored my respect amongst my peers. It could be recalled that in the SLBC's 2021 International Women's Day TV program, Sento Samoa was among the women profiled while cooking. That story exposed her constraints and brought in abundance and unexpected help for her and family. The International Women's Day coverage of 2021 of Sento and her family by Hawa Bari of the SLBS, um, I felt compelled to do something in order to help Sento's situation. Um, after watching the video clip, I called on a few friends and we came together and was able to raise funds for Sento. When Sento was involved in what we called in a local dialect Aujo cooking, she almost always falls sick after every cooking. But the change of her economic activity has had a significant change towards her health status. Health business, we say thanks to support. We got to the, the sick, sick, fast, 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 fast. Before now, Sento used to fall sick on frequent basis, but currently that has changed as she now hardly falls sick and she now has more time to rest. Once an extreme financial constrained home of Sento has now been transformed to less financial constrained home through a story told by our Barry on SLBC TV. What you've seen here today and heard from these people is what to call the power of the media and also the role the media can play in ensuring people get a befitting lifestyle. A year ago, she was undergoing serious stress and pains. She had to go out, cook for people before her family could live well. But today, because of the media, she does not need to go out to cook for people, but she has a business on her own. And life for her and her family currently is a bit better. For SLBC TV, I am Emmanuel Samora reporting from Owen Street Mountain Court.